I'm Courtney Hinshaw, and I teach fifth grade at Cypress Village Elementary in Irvine, California. I can't wait to tell you about the novel Out of the Dust. This book is about a young girl who lives during the Great Depression and the Dust Bowl. Billy Joe is a fantastic piano player, but when the odds are stacked against her, she must figure out how to rise above and still be true to who she is. There are so many different ways to use this book in your classroom, but the ways that I thought would be most beneficial for a fifth grader is teaching figurative language. There is so much great author's craft in this book where the author really gets you to feel like you're in the book and that you really build a connection with Billy Joe. You could teach what is a simile, what is a metaphor, what is an onomatopoeia, all those great author's craft words you can teach while reading the book and have the students highlight through the book where they see them. I want us to all channel ourselves back to when we were in middle school, when we did autobiographies. In the book, there are photographs of the Great Depression, and I think that would be a great activity for students to do with their own life, photographing their own life, and then sharing a story to match with the photo. It really warmed my heart reading about the Great Depression, and I think it would warm my students' hearts too, getting to learn more about their life. To build community in your classroom, one way is to read books. I would do a lot of foreshadowing with the book and a lot of pre-reading, bringing in articles about the Dust Bowl. Everyone goes through hard times in their life and this is how this person handled it and this is how you might handle it. But I would wanna do it in a group setting and so that my students could feel free to ask questions and they could feel free to be able to talk with their classmates but with an adult present. I really want my students to have knowledge of the Dust Bowl. As we know, many of our kids are not going to have that knowledge in 2022. Have your students research this time period to help them understand the tragedies that happened during the Dust Bowl. Again, our kids are all going to be processing this differently. Some are gonna have more knowledge than others. Many of us have been on online learning and what I started doing is I have a Google Drive journal for all my students. So every Monday they come in from library and I have a journal prompt waiting for them. And most of my journal prompts are social emotional learning based. Using journal prompts would be a great way to A, get your kids thinking about the text and also B, thinking about their own life and thinking about their Dust Bowl or their sunshines. During the pandemic, we've all faced in some varying degree hardship, but living in a life where everything is covered in dust and knowing how to still see sunshine through that, what a great lesson for all of our kids to learn about growth mindset and perseverance. You really need to go get out of the dust and put it in your classroom or home library. I cannot wait to hear how you use this book in your classroom and what your students think about it. I know they're gonna really love it.